hello guys welcome back so now uh, let's quickly add the progress bar okay we have to tell the user to please that we are registering your account so for that purpose we need to simply create a widget okay right click on widget new dot file we can give it name as loading underscore dialog loading dialog dot dot and let's quickly implement this first of all import the package material dot dot then we will create a stat list widget and we will give it name as a loading dialog widget we will pass only one thing here to this loading dialog widget as a parameter which will be basically the message that is what message we want in this loading dialog box to display okay so we will receive that by the name message just like this and then in the constructor of loading dialog widget we can simply say this dot message make sure to put curly braces first then we can simply say return alert dialog key key and the content of this you can use column widget main axis size main axis size dot minimum children widget and first of all we will display the circular progress so using the container widget we can say container alignment will be alignment dot center and let's apply some padding on it only from the top so we can say edge sets dot only from the top it will be 14 as it will be constant so add const modifier alongside with it and then we can simply say child const circular progress indicator and value color will be always stopped animation and the color will be colors dot pink accent just like this so this is our circular progress which we want to display in our alert dialog and then after it after it we want to display some text that is the message for example if you use this loading dialog on our sign up page after when the user click on sign up page then the message will be usually please wait while we are registering your account and so on okay so we can say here that is message dot to string comma and we will concatenate this with another string which will be please wait let's give some space here and a comma here for example if the message is let's say registering your account and after it it will display comma please wait so simple and so easy okay so this is basically a reusable widget loading dialog widget so let's say if you want to uh, add I mean if you want to uh, display a dialog, dialog box after let's say when the user click on the login button then we will just call this loading dialog widget and we will pass our message to it okay let's say if you want to display dialog box anywhere in our app let's say after clicking on the sign out button so we will just display a dialog box you are logged out so on okay this is so simple and so easy so anyways this is a reusable code which we can now access anywhere we want in our this project all we need is just we have to call it by the class name loading dialog widget and we have to provide the message parameter to it now how let me just show it to you for example as you know that on our registration tab page where we 
inside the form validation when we start uploading that is if everything goes successful okay if the form is validated then here we will simply call our loading dialog widget just like this and as you know it required one parameter which is the message so the message will be registering your account okay so this is passing as a message here to the loading dialog widget and it will be displaying like we will have a circular progress and then it will say registering your account comma please wait and as this is a dialog box so we have to call it inside a show dialog for example we have to just say show dialog just like this the first parameter is context second is the builder and we can say builder context C and we will say return and our loading dialog widget okay just like this so it will display this dialog which is our loading widget and if any error occur okay that is inside the else statement we have to if any error occur we will disappear this loading dialog box so we can say navigator dot pop context so it will make the loading dialog box disappear similarly if everything goes successful that is saving information to database if any error occur okay dot catch error so we will make the dialog box disappeared otherwise if no error occur and everything goes successful then we will make otherwise I mean there is no need to put this navigator dot pop here since we are sending the user to the home screen so it will automatically disappear the dialog box okay just like this so now let's just test the app to see how it is working the app is running now let's go to the registration let's choose any image for example this one I choose and I will give it name as Muhammad Ali Ali at the rate gmail.com then password of course confirm password and let's click on sign up so here we go registering your account please wait and after the successful registration the dialog box disappeared and it sent us to the home screen now one thing you may notice is basically we have to give some space here that is between the circular progress and the text so we can add here some size box which will make it more beautiful okay so height 16 that's it so now in the next video we will work on the login tab page